Hi folks, it's Colin here again from Salt Marine. Here is a fantastic SUV to show you today that's just arrived in. It's June 2020. It's the Renault Kijar 1.3 TCE. It's the iconic model. Icing on the cake, it's automatic as well, so very, very desirable. One private owner from you this car's had, and it's just done 18,500 miles with a fully documented Renault service history and five year Renault warranty as well. So it's under warranty until June 2025. It's absolutely spotless. It's finished in Arctic white metallic, which uh, was 625 pounds extra when the car was new. It's been maintained really, really well. There's not a mark on it. Uh, and I'll show you around the outside of the car first, spend a wee bit of time here, and then we'll concentrate on the inside of the car as well. So the first thing you'll see this particular example has 19 inch gloss black alloy wheels, all of which are absolutely unmarked, not a mark on any of them. We have LED running lights and headlights and LED rear lights. We have front fog lights as well. We have park assist and uh, reverse camera as well. Power folding door mirrors. Keyless entry on the car as well and privacy glass satin chrome roof rails, rear spoiler there as well as you can see and the reverse camera on the car as well. If you haven't driven one of these it's the 1.3 TCE, it's 140 horsepower so really lively, really smooth, fantastic driving car and I hope this will do it justice. It is metallic, that's the arctic white which is different from the glacier white and there's not a scrape on the car or a shopping trolley dent. Totally original, bodywork absolutely perfect as you can see. And uh, decent sized boot as well as you can see there. It even has the uh, rubber boot liner to protect the car as well. And the retractable luggage blind there too. Massive amount of room as you can see. And uh, you'll be able to see the rear spoiler better, the, uh, the satin chrome roof rails, the chrome window surrounds as well. And inside, well, have a look at this. We have half leather and then the cloth inserts, <clears throat> all of which are completely unmarked. It's never been a smoker's car. There's been no pets in here. Uh, center armrest, leather in the rear and in the front as well. Factory mats there in the car as well, as you can see. They have all your inputs for your phones and so forth there as well. So there's not a mark on the interior, the seating. There's no cracks in the leather. It's absolutely just as the car left the factory. That's the, uh, the front seats there center armrest, the leather flat bottom steering wheel, the latest touchscreen information center, dual climate control, and of course the auto gearbox there as well. Uh, and the full service history, of course, to back that up. And you can see the factory mats in the car there as well. Now, if we concentrate on the front of the car, along the bumper area here and the bonnet bonnet edge again not a stone chip on the car inside very very difficult to get in this condition keyless entry which is this little button here we get you in and out providing the key is in your pocket the four electric windows the electric and power folding door mirrors. Just a view there of the cockpit from the driver's side, as you would see it. So, uh, just a view there of the reverse camera. We've got the sensors and the little diagram of the car. And when we go back, you'll be able to see what happens here. So this goes red of course, the closer we get to an object. It works on the front the same as well. And of course you have that very, very useful 
reversing camera there as well. This is the uh, dual climate control here. So you've got the fan in the middle and then you have the temperature either side. And if you want your air conditioning on, obviously you can put it on and it is ice cold and working as it should do indeed. Just in case I forget, you've got the buttons here, one for cruise control, one for speed limiter, and then they are controlled with these switches here. This is the main menu then of the car, and on it you have all your uh, settings, your navigation, your vehicle, your system, your telephone, digital radio channels. You can go into vehicle there and you can see your driving assistance features here and that will show you that you've got lane departure warning which is on and you have speed alert settings as well so you've got the speed limit signs of the road you're on will appear as well as automatic lights you've also got automatic uh, main beam as well so you don't need to worry about uh, having to dip the headlights that will be done for you uh, automatically as well when there's a car coming towards you. You have the onboard computer here as well. It'll work out all your MPG and so forth there too. And your parking assistance, of course, as well, because you can adjust the parking sensors and the rear view camera there as well. And your system, of course, then too. You can go in and change the brightness and uh, the different uh, dynamics of the screen uh, as well as the interior lighting as well. Auto lights, auto wipers, as we mentioned there, the cruise control uh, configuration, and then a uh, voice activated Bluetooth. And then you can use these ones here. You can see just 18 and a half thousand miles on the car. You can scroll down then and get all of your other vehicle information, your fuel consumption, and so forth there as well. That's just the digital speedo reading that we have there at the moment. But all along the interior of the car, with two keys for the car, as I say, factory mats, all along the dash of the car as well, free, as I say, from any marks whatsoever. So a very, very difficult car to get, especially in the condition, with the mileage, one owner to back it up. So it's a June 2020, it's the Renault Kajar, it's the 1.3 TCE, 140 brake horsepower, iconic, automatic uh, Kajar. It's finished in... Uh, Glacier white metallic, just 18 and a half thousand miles, one private owner, full Renault service history, five year warranty with these at that particular time, five as well. Hopefully the video has given you an insight into how good the car is. I'm Colin, my colleagues are Mark and Chris. We would love to show it to you. Hopefully you know where we are. We're just 20 minutes from Sprucefield at Junction 14 on the M1 motorway, so really easy to find here as well. Hopefully We'll see you soon and thanks for taking the time to watch the video.